Duke Grant Sports Magazine presents UCYFL Football. Today's matchup pits the 9U Emerton Buccaneers Red versus the 9U Haverty Grace Warriors Gold. Both teams entered the game with identical 1-1 one -one records and we're looking to improve on that. The game shaped up to be quite the defensive battle as both teams tried to use the running game to set the tempo. But ball security and good defense stopped any plans of a high scoring game. Here you see number 44 of the Emerton Bucks trying to get outside only to be wrestled down by the aggressive Warrior defense. The ball was then turned back over to the Warriors who took the kick and tried to get some positive yardage. But that's when the Emerson defense showed up. Watch right over center. Number 23. Beautiful job. And a fumble and the Emerton Bucks get the ball right back. Ball security was a major issue in this game. As neither team can hold on to the ball. Here you see it going right back over to the Warriors. And then number nine slices to the outside and get some good yardage down the sideline and out of bounds. Now the Buccaneers look to be cooking with gas as they went to number 44 and he sliced right down the seam inside the 30 yard line. Oh, but the Warrior defense started to stiffen. Here you see 44 trying to go, but he's wrestled down by number 55 of the Warriors. And then, again, the Warriors get the ball back, only to lose it back to the Amateur Bucks. Now the Bucks are looking to cash in. If they get it to number 24, he slices, he dices, he breaks the tackle and goes in for the touchdown. This is what was needed. Some kind of boost. And as you see, 24 doing a great job of getting into the end zone. Watch this in slow motion as he goes through and finds the scene on the left side of the, of, of, of the defense. Here you see him dancing to the sideline, only to get hit by number 75. Looks like he's wrapped him up, but he breaks the tackle and goes in for the touchdown. Beautiful play by number 24 of the Emerton Buccaneers. And the ensuing extra point is no good. And the score, it's Emerton Buccaneers 6, Half of the Grace Warriors 0. But the Buccaneers won't go away easy. Here you see number 75 breaking to the left side of the field. He's going down the sideline and he's dragged down after a good game. See, the art of blocking is a beautiful thing. Watch this in slow motion. See where number 15 gets hemmed in by number 40? And it just screams number 75 for a long game. This is what teamwork, blocking, and execution is all about. But this is where the music stops for the Warriors. Try as they might, they couldn't find the room to run their offense as the defense of the Buccaneers stiffened. It made it very, very difficult for them to get anything going on off. The Warriors seem to spend way too much time backed up on their own side of the field as field position became a friend of the Emerton Buccaneers all day. Here you see them already down inside the 20, down by the 15 yard line. And then the Buccaneers dialed up number 21. 2.1 and he started doing his thing cooking him down inside the 15 yard and then again back to number 21 he's boogieing he looks like he's gonna score touchdown number 21 now watch this again in slow motion number 21 getting his groove on 
parties in case to go. Now I know he's looking, he's following this block. He's running the discipline route. Look at number nine, and number 44 in front. Then he blazes to the outside. How you like me now? Touchdown, number 21, Hamilton Buccaneer. The extra point, number 12, trying to get outside. Trying to get there, oh, just short, just short. Which leaves the score, Hamilton Bucks 13, Warriors 0. As the game went on, it was obvious that this would be a defensive battle. And the Bucks would make some big plays, like this interception by number 71. As you see, the Bucks coming out in their full house back here. Another big throw, this time to number 12. Beautiful catch. Watch this in slow motion. Watch the big fella get up. This is a beautiful catch. As you can see, both feet in the air and come down with that rock. That's the way it's supposed to be done, ladies and gentlemen. Now the quarterback is starting to air it out. As you see, he drops back again with this short conclusion. This time to number 10. Now the Bucks are starting to move the chains. First to number 21, and then quick to number 15 as he blasts to the outside and into the end zone for a touchdown. Beautiful execution by the Buccaneers. If you watch this replay, you'll see that all the red shirts are in the inside, fooling the Warriors, only for number 15 to break to the outside. There you see, he has a clear lane to the end zone. Beautiful execution, again, great coaching, great execution by the Buccaneers. Again, as they line up for the extra point, it's good. And now the Buccaneers stretch their lead to 21 to nothing. And the defense right back to work, smothering the Warriors in anything that they tried to do. At times the Warriors did show promise. And they proved that they have a good team, but they were just outmanned on this day by a superior Buccaneers team. Did they belong to that Buccaneers defense? And everything they tried seemed to have worked. And in the end, the Buccaneers were just a little better than the Warriors and came away with a 21 to nothing win. Thanks for watching. And remember, if you can't attend the game, you can always watch it with the Duke. Duke Grant Magazine, home of the absolute best. Young dudes in sport.